Hey and welcome to this video, it's Derek, your online English teacher who is Scottish. Derek, ton professeur d'anglais en ligne qui est franco-écossais. In this video, I will give you 12 words that are very important and crucial if you are an English learner and if you are a beginner. So you can follow this video, you will get great content. But before, you can subscribe by clicking right there or you can click uh, underneath if you are on your mobile. I can show you how to do it like that or like this. I used to be a, a hip-hop dancer. I'm no longer a hip-hop dancer. However, I still love hip-hop. Anyways, you uh, subscribe, you just follow the lessons and you will get great content. Uh, all the videos are in French except the first video of the month. So we are the 2nd of October, so that's why the video is in English. And you can subscribe also to the newsletter just underneath and you will get great content. Let's go back to our words. 12 words to know, to master, to understand if you are a beginner, an English learner. My means, for example, my phone. This is my phone, my, I, diphthong, I. This is me, me, uh, it's me. <laughs> it's not my, the possession, this is me, my person. Her is the object, so it's, it's for a girl. I love her, for a girl. I don't love she, I love her. Uh, I like him, him is for a boy, I've got two boys, I've got Noah and I've got Joseph. I could say, I like him, I like Noah, I like him too, I like Joseph. Him is for a boy. Your is like my, but for you. Your phone. So for example, this is my phone and uh, he could say this is your phone. Okay, it's not my phone, it's your phone. Just it's an adjective, uh, it's a little bit like French, I guess you can understand it, just. Uh, can, oh, very important, this is a model. It means the ability. I can speak English, I can speak English. The ability, the capacity to do something. No, very easy. Um, negative sentence, no, or negation. Right, good, so right, uh, for example, if this is written, right, yeah. Will, it's a model. Uh, you use it to make a sentence in the future. Uh, you can use it for, uh, it's a noun, a will. Uh, it could be a, a, a name, will, if it's a capital letter. So uh, this is mainly used to talk about future. I will come tomorrow. Love, oh, very important word. Love, love, love. <laughs> and uh, to finish, end, because this is the last list I'm going to give you. I had three um, videos about the t most important words in English. A first video with 12 words, a second video with another 12 words, and this is the last video with a last, a last series of 12 words. So I'm going to finish by saying this is the end. Please, 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 before you say bye-bye, click on the link over there, subscribe so we can see each other again. And I hope you'll have a lovely day. Bye-bye.